<clears throat> Hello everyone and welcome back to what I'm calling France at the moment because I'm really into this playlist at the moment. We have a special guest today and I'm really excited because we've been trying to get Shep on the channel for so long and I feel really sorry for him because I think he's up at some insane time right now and he lost his beard which is even more crazy if you've been watching his streams recently. Um, but these guys have finally gotten together. They're doing a Monte Cristo challenge. So the idea is Chef has a really crazy twist on this idea, which they'll explain a little bit more to you. And Wolfie has taken Chef's idea and is going to twist it into his own creation again. So it's just a bit of fun. It's all very chill. We're just really excited to have both um, guys on board. But there is going to be a delay with chef which i'll explain we've had a few technical issues which always happens when you're trying to do collaborations with people so chef currently is listening via the stream so there's going to be a bit of a delay when we talk to him but it should be fine he's also watching the stream um and we have um nouveau in the chat who's with him at the moment and so he um she's going to be giving over some questions as well. Hello, Nevo. So, if you guys have not followed Chef, please do. He's a huge supporter of our channel. I'm going to throw to one of you guys. Uh, Wolfie, we'll shall, start we, with, shall we throw to you we'll first? Start with Chef. Are going to start with Chef? We're going to start with Chef. Chef, talk yeah, to us. Tell us about your of, crazy creation. Right. Well, thanks for that warm introduction. <laughs> What's gonna get internet to work? Well, I'll work on that while you. One of my friends from Europe asked me, uh, sometime last year, about the U.S. obsession with waffles and, and chicken, and uh, somehow or other, I, I, I tried to figure out the most outrageous thing I could do with waffles and chicken. I thought, why don't I just make a sandwich and batter that and deep fry it? So that monstrosity uh, turned out very, very well. Last week, I gave it another try. And uh, in the meantime, Wolfie and I were looking at some sort of a collab. And uh, here we are. So it wasn't really a take on the Monte Cristo. It's just what the folks in my Discord named it, the Monte Vlacos. It's, it's the same idea. That's amazing. So what okay, are you sense. doing, Wolfie? In return, um, in return, I will be making something more akin to a classic Monte Cristo. Um, I will be using slightly variation of degrees uh, of the ingredients. Excuse me, can't talk right now. Focusing on apple, um, uh, rather than using like a uh, thick white bread, I don't have a waffle maker, which is also why I'm <clears throat> making a modification to this. Uh, so I will be doing a sourdough bread, and I will be making the chicken into a kind of cordon bleu schnitzel and i'll explain that more in a little bit um i did want to go ahead and give a bit of a history lesson the um monte cristo was originally invented around the 1940s in a in the coronado hotel in san diego california um it was a play on what is called a fuck monsieur which is a similar kind of um, ham and cheese and bread sandwich, though that one is usually topped with a uh, Mornay sauce. If you all remember from my stream, that is a, a, a cheese added bechamel um, and then baked so that you get a nice little brown topping on it. Um, we won't have the Mornay this time. We will instead have Chef's lovely variation involving um, syrup. And, uh, I'm not sure if he had jam in it or not, but mine will have an apple butter um, as the addition as as money crystals tend to have a jam served with them mm -hmm. all right <clears throat> so how do you want to do this are we just gonna this is the first time we've done a proper collab like this so are we just gonna and am, am i just gonna be like ready set i am chef <laughs> I figured I'm just going to uh, start prepping all my ingredients in order, and uh, I think Wolfie's going to be doing the same. Yeah. 
Yeah, no, my delay is actually not too, too bad. Uh, so I'm just going to get my dredging ready and uh, for me, I'm going to be setting up the chicken. I'm going to start the buttery caramel syrup, make some waffles, and then I will uh, start assembling and then the deep frying. When I get to the deep frying, I'll move my camera a lot closer. Nice. All right, what are you going to start with? Until then, I'll mute myself. Okay, um, yep, no, I'm that works. Start... I'm going to start with the protein since, uh, again, my breading is a bit simpler than making a waffle mix. And I will begin by flattening out my chicken. And um, I'm going to get a little pan of oil going here so that I can have something to do a, like a, sl a small pan fry for the outside of the chicken. Okay, I need to catch up on the chat as well. Hello, everyone. And a warning warning to anybody um, that likes to use you know, oils or anything like that at home, do not keep them in the sunlight. They go rancid faster. It's better to keep them in a closed cabinet. That, oh my God, you're making me think about my my storage now. Because, yeah, I keep mine right next to my stove. <laughs> I, well, I want to say as well, heat heat is a problem for going rancid, but also like the the color of the containers. Uh, you saw that one was clear. I keep yeah. that one in the cabinet. These olive oil containers are very dark. They don't let as much sunlight in. So these are okay to set on my counter, but it's not still not in direct sunlight. It's in passive sunlight. Uh, okay. All right. By that I mean it's coming through a drape. Where did I put that chicken? My open jail case under the sink. Oh my god. I actually I actually don't think I realized that. Um now I realize I also realize unfortunately that we do have a bit of pixelation on Chef's side. But it's gonna be okay. I will continue to work on that. It might be um the the location of Discord being a bit of a pain as well. Um but I like to think it will suddenly fix itself in the magic that is the internet. Hello, so, everyone. Let me let me catch up on everyone. I'm really sorry. So, Doom, Lumen, Mrs. Wheat, Spartan, Probable Wheat, Muddled Films, Mock, Silver, Chloe's here. Uh, have I missed anyone? That's all of you, isn't it? Yes. Hello. Hello, everyone. Thank you. Thank you for... Uh, Supporting oh, you, lovely people. Um, yes, it, it Doom very specifically highlighted his message Burger King foot lettuce, which um hasn't really been explained but was noted by all. Thank you, Doom, for that really important community announcement. <laughs> oh, look at the chicken. Doom speaks to the people. I miss the chicken. I'm so good. <laughs> I just like it switched and I was like, damn it. <laughs> I missed it. Oh, it's okay. All I did was take this was one of my um one of my airline chicken breasts from the a couple streams ago that I had in the freezer. All I did was take the shoulder bone off and I'm removing the skin now. I'll be saving this for crack ones later. The reason why I'm doing this is over here, I'm going to be brining my chicken for about half an hour. So just one cup of water, one tablespoon of salt. I'm going to whisk this together, shove my chicken in there so it's fully submerged to the refrigerator for half an hour. And the salt is going to do a wonderful job of penetrating the meat and uh, drawing some of the bad moisture out and leaving that beautiful seasoning inside. If you want to do something really funky, instead of salt and water, you can use pickle juice. It's, it's a little oh. unexpected, yeah, so warn your different. guests before you feed them chicken flavored pickles or pickle flavored chicken. It's so interesting. I can see that being delicious, though. Yeah. I, I like, like, if I make myself a grilled cheese, for instance, I will just have a side of pickle juice with it to dip the sandwich in. Like three eggs. 
I don't feel like making boom crashes today, so I'm going to do my chicken slightly differently than I usually do when I flatten it. I'm going to roll it out. You can any method of brushing works when you're um, thinning something. Or you could do it Doom style, where you just punch your chicken. <laughs> my personal favorite. Like I said, no, no boom crafting this time. I'm just going to put my body weight onto it and make it feel like it's at home. Yeah, yeah, chef brining at the moment. Is this is this the pickle juice? Could be. No, he said he was just going to use water and vinegar. Ah, I was seeing this pink. I think uh, tinge to it, but that that could be what's in the background. Oh, it's probably the chicken. That makes sense. Chicken. I'm using some uh, fancy, fancy pink Himalayan salt for those extra trace minerals. I'm oh, trying to ah, okay, I, this... thought, I thought that was the case. That's what it is. I was like, I'm seeing more pink. <laughs> I got some myself here. You know. A good mineral salt. So we're trying to go for mine. Pretty friggin' thin. Doom. Penetrating the meat. Yes, phrasing. Thank you. Thank you, Doom. <laughs> Chloe says, Doom best chef. I've never seen anyone handle their meat the way he does. He does it in such a unique way. Oh, and speaking of handling my meat, I'm going to be washing my hands about 40 times this, this stream because, uh, I'm I'm pretty clean, and I don't like salmonella. Clean, clean is good. I I appreciate the clean. I'm also going to give a shout out to Navari, um, because she's working quite hard in the background for Chef, to 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 keep him in line, <laughs> make sure everything's going keep him well. In line. Um, so beat that meat. Yeah, as you can see, I've given up on rolling it, and I've resorted to beating it. Sometimes force is just easier. <laughs> I'm also holding it up so that I don't reverberate through my neighbors. I'm trying to be very polite right now. Maybe they... Yeah, okay, no fair. Do you... Did you sell tape it on? No, what do you call it? Tape it? Did you tape it on? No, I just got it laying on top. Huh. Cellophane works via static electricity, but if it gets moist, it also likes to stick to stuff, and so that's it using the chicken as its grip. Okay, man. That makes sense. I'm working from the center out doing this. So I'm flattening from the middle to the outward. You spread the chicken as large as you can. Exactly. Good morning. How are you, cat? Well done, Mikey Jackson. No, no, no. I want this super, super thin. It'll make it cook easier. And it'll make it roll easier. Very delicate compared to how I would deal with that. I'm not trying to put holes in it. The other part of, point of wrapping it was so that I wouldn't have to deal with watching the thing. You say this, if I made a hole, I'd just kind of try to mush it back together. What's cooking? This is a special guest, and we are making Chef Klaus's version of a Monte Cristo. And Chef Wolfie is then making their version of Chef's Monte Cristo. It gets it gets confusing, but but just stay with us. <laughs> We're leveled in, right? Yeah, yeah. This is like Inception. This looks delicious. I will be right back. Um, I broke a glass earlier this week, and I think I just stepped on a little bit of it. I'm not uh... injured. I just need to my thought. All right. Okay. As long as you're okay. Oh, no. Ow. Oh, it's an SSG. I'm writing out. Well, I'll, be, I'll try to be entertaining out. in the meantime. I told you, I am on never home. buy brown sugar. This wonderful stuff in here is regular sugar and molasses. 
Mm. Much easier to manage and deal with. One tablespoon of molasses per cup of sugar gives you a cup of brown sugar. It's not exactly. a weird substitution. It's literally components of regular brown sugar, like raw sugar. When you remove the molasses, you're left with white sugar. There's no destruction of anything. Mm -hmm. So brown sugar equals white sugar plus molasses. Sugar minus molasses is white sugar. My very simple. Yeah. So all I'm doing here is I'm uh, going to slowly melt a bunch of sugar, brown sugar, brown sugar, with some water. Adding water to any sort of a caramel is a, it's an easy way to make sure you don't burn your caramel because this won't start to burn at a reasonable temperature anyways. This won't start to burn until the water is fully evaporated. When you normally make a caramel, you take your pot of sugar and you're constantly stirring it to make sure all of the sugar is at the same temperature and it melts and caramelizes at a consistent rate. You can avoid screwing up by putting some water in here. The water slows down that entire process and it gives you lots of time to, uh, to make your adjustments and make sure you're still stirring. So I'm going to slowly bring this to temperature and uh, let the sugar and caramel action happen. Thank you. Are you okay, Wolfie? You look okay. Yeah. He seems alright. He's fine. He's working. Like I said, I went out to the I just, my sock had glass in it. So I just changed my sock out. Alright. I'm also going to do something very quickly because um, I would prefer our guest to be in full resolution versus our normal chef. Um, so I'm going to really quickly switch the sources. Um, so give yeah, me... Give me five seconds. Hang on. Look. In the meantime, what I will be doing is it's I will be okay. rolling my chicken with um I uh I didn't feel like using ham because I already had some uh what is this stuff called? Oh, I'm drawing a blank. That's terrible. I'm using pastrami. That's it. I wanted a little bit of a spicy meat. Oh, unfortunately. And it it is chef sauce. I was trying to fix it, but it looks like. Damn, really? I don't think I can fix it. That is a shame. That's all right. We 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 tried. I I really wanted to to try, but um, yeah. Let me... Get two little rolls like that, and then what I'm gonna do? Because I want this to fit in the sandwich. <clears throat> That's not good. Okay, well, my best with what I have. Yeah. Got a, a double bowl going on on the chest. Oh, no, no, it's a type of bowl. I'm looking at properly now. <laughs> that metal bowl of his? Or the glass one? It's a really good use on plus as well. It's a big bag. Wow. This is where you come for the really good cooking commentary. Wow. You're welcome. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I'm uh, right now I'm <laughs> I'm very tightly rolling my chicken. Here you go. Um oh. I want to see you roll your chicken. Oh. I've already rolled it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of flatten it back out um, this way <clears throat> so that it will cook a bit more evenly. This meat nice and tight. Yep. And make it into the sandwich and I'm just going to flatten it like, like doom wood. Like doom wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give it CPR. Oh no, it's insides are coming out. No, that's just that's just plastic. It's okay. Uh, uh, okay. Definitely that definitely shouldn't happen when you give things CPR though. Don't let their insides the, the, come out. Yeah, don't let the insides come out. Oh, oh my gosh, that's okay. 
Thank you so much for the for the biddies. I really really appreciate that. We don't have we don't have a fish bowl up at the moment, so so we. But I assure you, all the gummy bears will go towards feeding the fish, which is healthy for for the fish. Yeah, I I like to um I like to keep them on a permanent sugar high. I think it I think it keeps them happy. Keeps them something for sure. Let me. I think I saw a chef put in some salt into the flour. I'm going to guess. It seems like a chefy thing to do is to put salt into the flour. Um, that is definitely a chefy thing to do because you want to season the thing that you're deep frying. Burner, I swear. This is the basic it's pancake worse. mix. Ah. Uh, Waffle batter is basically pancake batter, but add a, a bit more water or cream to thin it out a bit more. This is just all-purpose flour, some sugar, baking powder, and some salt. I'll be adding some uh, whole milk, an egg, and a little bit of unsalted butter. Oh, yeah, yeah, nice. And a little bit of my world-famous vanilla extract. <laughs> oh, oh that was a primer, wasn't it? Does the body good? You can see the vanilla beans in there. Uh, this this is really top shelf stuff, and I highly recommend you make your own. This is just vodka and vanilla beans. That's it. That's it. Let it hang out for half yep, a that's year. It. And this that is about good. as good quality as you can buy in a store. Huh. Vodka and vanilla beans. I didn't even realize. Okay, that was that was a good tip. That was a really good tip. beating more things I'm currently just making my dredge I'm whipping up some eggs right now and I will be putting together on um, this bowl here you see it's got half a cup of cornstarch and half a cup of flour and I'm just going to be adding some a little bit of spicing to that this is the dredge for the chicken and because just so nobody freaks out when they see me do it I'm going to be baking this entirely. I'm not going to cook the chicken through when I do the pan fry. I'm going to bake it to, to finish. So I am going to use this as my French toast mix as well. Okay, okay, okay. That makes sense. And, and I saw a chef grab some milk and held out an egg. We're kind of like up to the same stages. This is what I'm kind of noticing. Just about, yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. using the baking in place of his brining. So we're like, yeah. well, we, should, we should be on the same time frame. Yeah, you guys are. It's kind of interesting to go back and forth because it's like, yeah, very, very similar. This chicken dredge, I'm adding salt, pepper. Time for the eggshell hack. What's the eggshell hack? Is it baking it and crushing it for plants? And paprika? Oh yeah, I know the plant thing, huh? Where is it? Where is it? I'm looking yeah. for my spiky stuff. All right, oh, I'm is. watching. I'm excited. You practice I the see. old school way or the uh, the savage way? Oh, the savage way! <laughs> wow, that didn't take a second. Nice. <laughs> that was that was great. <laughs> I'm doing well, it. I'm doing it separately. It's very likely that there won't be any splinters of eggshell in here, but because there aren't, I'm going to feed some eggshell into the egg <laughs> and show off the best way to remove eggshells uh -huh. from your mix. That is in my hand. I already have nature's very own patent pending eggshell scooper picker upper cup. There's something really neat about the geometry of a broken eggshell. It cuts right through the egg white. You just get underneath the eggshell, lift your cup straight up. Like magic, oh. you have to scoop this out. The eggshell lands magically inside of the cup. If you can't get underneath, you can always just nudge the eggshell piece up the side of your bowl, just using the, uh, the eggshell itself. This will not work with the spoon or your fingers, and don't do any sort of weird 
empty hosen shop vac to try to pick things up. It doesn't work. Um, th this is one of the few kitchen hacks that, that I endorse. And I even have an emote to celebrate it. Oh, wow. That's actually That's really amazing. cool. We unfortunately had to watch it in like six pixels, but you could actually see it. So that was really cool. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Silver says, yeah, I learned this from mum back when she still worked in hospitality. Huh, okay. Oh, yes. You missed it? Doom, it was like, if you ever want to get eggshells when you crack it, you use the the eggshell itself because something to do with the construction of the shell itself will make it easier to cut through. Yeah, use the eggshell to get the eggshell out. Well, I use the eggshell to get the egg. I'm playing chicken with Chef's Internet. It's so funny. Every time I'm not on it, it's crystal clear. And every time I switch over, it goes to six pixels, and I'm like, God damn it! <laughs> Just... <laughs> Stay. I'm sorry, Doom. I uh, I did not know that my he was getting so pixelated. Shame on me for tech issues today. It's alright. The eggshell cup in your hand is a perfect way to pick up. I ho I'm assuming the audio works fine. Yes. Uh, the eggshell. Yeah, audio is good. The the half egg shell. Think of it as a cup, and you just go into your bowl with your egg. The unfortunate pieces. Get underneath and then just rotate the eggshell and lift straight up. Yeah, the eggshell pieces will come up with your cup. And uh, it's a great way to remove eggshells from that you don't want. And because I normally try to use farm fresh eggs, I always break my eggs over a separate bowl just in case. And, uh, and then I transfer that somewhere else. It's also a good habit when you're uh, separating eggs. It is indeed. Normally on screen, I'll separate an egg just by transferring the yolk back and forth between the two halves of the cracked egg. Um, in the real kitchen setting, you just take your fingers, spread them out a little bit, and just drop the egg in there. You have the yolk in your hand, and all the white goes through, and figure out what container is getting what. Try not to mix that up. <laughs> I usually have a third bowl off to the side just in case the egg yolk breaks and I don't want to contaminate the whites and vice versa. It all ends up being used anyways. Damn, you just went to make cereal. I'm shaking my head at you. I'm shaking my head at you. Okay, let's get back. Then the flour well and poured the milk unacceptable. And eggs in. Unacceptable. unacceptable. Fruity pebbles. No one cares about your fruity pebbles, Doom. Get out of here. You're making much <laughs> crystals. Get with the program. Forgot. <laughs> you guys like bro just wanted some cereal. No one cares. Get out of here. You processed, not fresh cooked food. <laughs> Chloe's <laughs> hiding a cereal. We don't want cereal in here. We want money crystals. Yeah. Fruity pebbles are amazing and gluten free. I have never had fruity pebbles. I'm gonna. I'm gonna admit it. Sarah Rice cereal. Ah. Oh, we got the toasty maker out. What, what do you, oh no, it's a waffle maker, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Oh, look at that little brush. I get excited over things that are just meant to be. I don't know why. It's okay to be excited over food. That's what we're here for. Yeah, well, I'm excited over a brush right now, but you know. This is they're like if Rice Krispies and Fruit Loops had a baby. Huh. Yeah, that's that's a great way to put it. See this going. Yeah. 
see I can see the beating happening. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Okay, look, this is gonna be Matthew's law. Watch the second I go away. Oh, you're using chopsticks. Yeah. Oh, I like that. I don't like using metal in my pans, and my plastic one would have probably melted under the heat of that. So I, I, I second guess myself. That makes sense. It makes sense. Um, I'm making my French toast mix right now, and what I've done so far is uh, I've added um, a third of a cup of milk and heavy cream to these eggs. It, a good ratio is about a third of a cup per egg. I have three eggs, so I'm going a little less because I want this to be more of a sticky mixture. Um, I have added cinnamon nutmeg. I need to add sugar still, um, but I have gone ahead and put in some of my um, cognac, and I'm going to zest an orange into this. A good yeah. trick, if you happen to like making French toast a lot and you plan on keeping it over a day, is to uh, separate your whites and your yolks utilizing chef's patented method um, and um, whisking in your uh, spices. Um, as, as many people will probably find when you make this stuff, the spices like the float on the top. So if you whisk your spices into the egg yolks, the fat creates the matrix around them and holds them in place. And then you mix that back into your egg whites and your other mixture. Keeps everything mixed properly. I did not do that. I did not feel like it. Dan, please don't put babies in your mouth. You've got a big knob of butter, as the hairy bikers would say, in the pan right now on Chef's side. Why would the hairy bikers say that? I don't know. It's just their thing. Every time I watch the hairy bikers, they're always like, big knob of butter. It's like Jamie Oliver putting oil on everything. Olive oil specifically. Yeah. Yeah, it's just I don't know. Can't cook, so, I mean that's that's a whole other story. It's just a thing. It's just a thing. Mix nicely in. We'll add our sugar. And the same breadth of what Chef Blouse is doing. I will be using brown sugar. I do not have molasses made sugar. I did very much consider doing that and using some of my uh, black garlic molasses, but oh, yeah. I am a little tired from a tattoo appointment I had yesterday. It wore out my body more than I expected, so I'm being a little lazy today. <laughs> You'll leave in a few minutes, Doom. We'll miss you. We'll talk about you constantly. We'll be like, do you remember when Doom was here? Do you remember Doom? Doom was great. I'll make fun of you. We'll keep your memory alive. Don't worry. I thought you meant negatively. No. I do have troubles controlling oh. my sarcastic tone, though. You know. Ooh. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is happening. We're going to make the waffles. I'm excited. You ready? You ready? The waffles. Batter one. Hey, batter, 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 batter. Batter two. Looks like a nice crunchy. Batter three. Oh, run! So beautiful. So beautiful. Hey, oh! Like this. Oh, no! I thought that was going to go into... <laughs> Maker. We're safe. Batter is safe. Made base. Okay. 
Waffles are so powerful, they, they cancel the, the magnets that are holding the lights in place. That's how powerful. <laughs> it, I think it's so the vanilla powerful. extract, actually, yeah, that yeah. demagnetized the area. It's just, just that powerful. It's just that powerful. <laughs> oh, you're grinding now. We've gone from beating to grinding over in the Waffy Corner. The Waffy Corner? My, yeah, my, close enough. I don't like this panko. It's really thick, so I'm just breaking it up a little bit. I actually, here's a fun fact. I used to call Wolfie Waffles, but spelt with like Waffle. a U because of Wolfie because he yeah. was a breakfast chef when I met him. So Waffles. There you go. You can call him Waffles from now on. I won't mind. Very affectionate. It's beaming. Look at it. I never knew it was because you knew I was a breakfast chef, though. You just started calling me it one day, and you never explained it. Oh, I never explained my genius? Yeah, that was why. Nope, nope. you just went for I it. I just I went like, oh, for it. I went about my day. And you're like, oh, okay. Yeah, that was because that you were a breakfast chef. It made sense to me. It does make sense. Also, if you guys want this recipe that Chef's cooking at the moment, I have pinned it along with Please Go Follow, our special guest. Um, but there is a very, very good blog that I recommend because I like all the keto recipes called The Daily Bear. The Daily Bear. I smelled like orange liqueur. That's exactly what I was going for. Put this back over here, actually. It's all gone a bit quiet on the chef front. Oh no, there's one. I've spotted it in the wild. It found bread. Oh, today's recipe. There you guys. I did find bread. I have a nice store-baked uh, sourdough uh, loaf. I'm just going to cut on a super hard bias to give me the shape that I want for the chicken. Got to figure out how, how hard this bias needs to be. I have a fondness for sourdough back from my sugar, complete sugar fructose free days because it has no sugar in it. That's why I get sourdough. It's not. Yeah. That is why I chose it because I already have plenty of sugar in the mix. This is it. While the Monte Cristo is a sweet sandwich and served with a jam, I didn't want to go super heavy with syrup on my end. Or sorry, of sugar on my end. Come on, bread knife, do you think? the right angle. Yeah, this is a nice, really soft loaf. Mm. Oh, actually quite tangy for sourdough. Nice. I like the tang when it comes through. Like, because it's supposed to be sourdough, right? Yeah, but sour is tangy. It's that thing that activates your lymph nodes and makes you, makes you salivate. There we are. All right. We'll cover my chicken nicely. And where it's so soft, it'll suck up that French toast mix. I run this side. I think we're waiting we're waiting for the waffles i just keep staring at it excited oh okay. yeah waffles depending on the iron you have take between two and four minutes that makes sense well you just know this oh yeah you're a breakfast chef never mind yeah that's why 
that was like we don't use the waffle makers often we don't use them as mine or anything we use it for banquets oh look at them a little more a little more okay yeah 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 two minutes okay i gotta head out now oh doom oops that was a bit harsh was bye doom transition and professional bye bye Love you. Doom. Thanks for tuning in. Oh, almost done. As soon as I pop these out, I'm going to let them hang out on this uh, cooling rack for a bit, and I will get started on the chicken. I just have a very, very basic dredge here of a cornstarch flour. The recipe's on the, the blog. Um, salt, pepper, paprika, you know, the, the usual culprits, just whisk together. I'm going to... Yep. Just a basic egg wash, whisk up an egg, uh, dip the chicken in either side, throw it in here. You can dip it twice, and there are some uh, chicken recipes um, call for using like a buttermilk, letting the chicken soak in the buttermilk mm -hmm. for a while, which the acid in the buttermilk also helps tenderize the chicken a little bit. And uh, that just mm -hmm. lets things stick a bit better. So you have your liquid on your chicken. After you dry it, make it wet again, dip it into the breading. Optionally, make it wet again, back into the breading. Hopefully everything sticks, and that goes into your deep fryer. Because I'm pan frying the chicken, it's a, it's a little less uh, a little less interesting. It's a little less uh, effective because some of the breading is going to fall off. It's only In fact, it did do... If I, in fact, did do a double dredge on mine, I wanted that extra crispiness, and um, I would have used buttermilk had I wanted to tenderize the chicken, but I beat the absolute shit out of it, so I didn't feel like that part was necessary. Oh, look at it. It's so beautiful. Yes. I'm going to carry them off to the bedroom to eat them. To the bedroom? <laughs> That's where I eat all my central food. Waffles sweet, aren't sweet rocket waffles. science. <laughs> and it, uh, it helps a lot if you have the, the right tool. Normally, I don't go for gadgets. Um, this is kind of essential. Yeah, a little hard to make a waffles without a waffle iron. Thank you for the nerd neck check. Actually kind of starting to, to slouch in, in hunger. I mean, this microwave is a gadget, right? What the? Oh, yeah. What's well, fun is I didn't own a microwave for the first two years <laughs> I lived here. There, there's still some chicken in there that's not quite done. Otherwise, I would use this for tempering chocolate. But uh, yeah, this is like one of the few gadgets that I own my microwave. Oh, I see. Shiny. Oh, this is going to be a hell of a sandwich. Oh, I wish the internet was behaving so I could have seen it, but it looks so good. I, I consider it like a teaser. It's like if you want to see Chef uncensored without pixels, you should go subscribe. What a tease. I know. What a tease, right? It's a true tease. That was adorable. It was so cute and tiny. Phrasing. It brings micro in microwave. Oh, that was, that was so good. That was so good. That that wins it. We're done. <laughs> Back up. That's the season over. Oh my god. What's what's going on, Orphy? What is, right oh, now, my god. I'm, <laughs> oh my god. I'm giving it the panko dredge and I'm trying not to crush my bread because it's super soft and also very wet right now. Oh my god, this is where the challenge comes in. Oh my god. It's working, it's working okay. Just okay. walking it through the breading. I almost feel like I'm making a KFC double down it's if it weren't for the Right? The bread. I'm like, what is going on? Oh my goodness. Okay. Mine is ready for the oven. Amazing. So 
we will have more of our attention on Chef from this point on because you will only see baking on my side. But that is my finished product. Oh my God, Perfect look timing. at that thing. Absolutely, Chef. So he, one thing my job is about, it is timing. That's that's quite the, the sub sandwich there, Wolfie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, absolutely. I am eggs fucking excited for this okay, thing. Over here, I have the chicken tandy. I don't know if you saw me trimming it off. Nice. Yes. I'm going to be squishing this all dry. Paper towels. I use a silly amount of paper towels. Um, I do the same. I do the same. Just to help things stick a little better, I'm going to check the moisture and see how well this uh, this breads up. And I'm not going to be pounding the chicken boob flat. I'm going to be holding it down using my relatively insanely sharp knife. I will be cutting parallel to the surface and hopefully make two perfectly evenly shaped chicken boobs. Today, yeah. I am not doing a bacon weave. Because uh, I, oh, no. I did the math. Without the bacon, these chicken waffle waffle sandwiches are over 2,000 calories each. With the bacon and the Swiss cheese, probably 23, 2400 calories, oh which God. is a little more than I want in my lunch, <laughs> let alone my entire day. So essentially, we've just turned into epic meal time for, a, for an episode. Yeah, I kind of. Yeah. What? What? I'll set your butter. Yeah, yeah. yeah, don't look at my screen page. That's a damn. I'm not doing shit. What are you eating? <laughs> Sourdough. <laughs> are you just dipping it in butter? <laughs> this is my toasty butter. It's got a lot of flavor to it. If you ever make ghee at home, make it a little toasty, you will never have butter the same. It's fucking delicious. Don't look at me. It's just dipping bread in butter. <laughs> you never have buttered toast? It's like fairy bread, but without the sugar. You should put the butter on the toast, not the toast on the butter. Okay, so what do we I'm see doing here, Chef? Because I've got not too many pixels, but I can definitely see it's like round, yellowish things. This is what my clarified butter usually ends up looking like. Ah, oh, um, that makes sense. I don't know if that green tint is allowed to be discussed in Australia. Oh my god. <laughs> There's about 15 milligrams of fun substance for every third of a teaspoon. We can talk about it in Canberra. <laughs> I used to hit this, uh, let's just keep calling it clarified butter, I asked chef, Twitch from if a I could of make it. They job. said uh, they have to enforce all the laws of every country. I said that's patently impossible. And they said, yeah. go ahead. Ah! Sweet. Yep. Done. Implicitly, they said, go ahead. Sweet. We now, know. the stuff they would send me was this dark, I've, dark I've green I've made pop brownies on Twitch several times, and uh, nobody's ever complained. As long as you don't, like, advertise what you're doing. Legal in some countries. It's very confusing at this point, where it's, like, legal in some place and another. I don't know. My, um, we got this new olive oil in recently at work, and it is, like, the darkest green shit I've ever seen. It looks exactly like some good butter. I think it's just not filtered in some way, but it's super dark green. Taking the green stuff, I need to put my dill uh, word we're talking about over here. This is a clear glass jar. There's lights behind it. Like, well, it's very, very green. Yeah, that is super green. I thought that was tinted. That's actually really amazing. Oil's especially been buttered. It doesn't have the flavor. Game. This is what you're talking about earlier, slicing off the the unwanted bits. 
the rejected bits of chicken society. I reject no portion of chicken. That's straight. I use it all. Wow. Ha. Ha ha. Ha. Uh, Ben, though. Yeah, in a commercial setting, you get your ass fired uh, in a kitchen if you waste anything. I know. <laughs> I'm I'm okay with trimming off like one or two percent of my meats, but in in a, in a real restaurant, you get laid alive with wet noodles for doing that. The green oil. Nah, I um. I can I can certainly say on my end with bad butchers we've had we just don't let them do it anymore. Really? Huh? If you suck at something, we just put you on something else, and if you suck at everything, we cut your hours until you quit. Oh God. Nice. Look at it. So yeah, that's that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> Chloe said, every part oh. wasted will be replaced by parts from you. Goodness. Yeah. <laughs> Wolfie approves. <laughs> the evil laugh as well. Remind me not to ever apply for Wolfie's kitchen. <laughs> yeah. I think the evil is contextual. I think my laugh sounds just fine. Yeah, yeah. No, it's it's beautiful, darling. Very normal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm reminded of Shadow Cat's earlier message. Flower. Nice. So he said you have a lovely laugh, Wolfie, with a little love heart. Oh, why well, thank you, Chloe. I'm actually a fan of when I cook my chicken, dusting it in flour first before I pan fry. It just kind of, I don't know, it softens in the texture. I just really like it. Getting ready. My um, I guess my ID. My kind of figure out a really nice way to put this. I really like this guy. Um, my mom's husband um makes apple butter. Really, really, really good apple butter. I will be using that as my jam. Oh, bring it back! Bring it back! Let's see. Yeah. Nice. He's a very good cook, actually. That's apple butter? Yeah, this is apple butter. Red. It's brown, actually. Oh, okay. Yeah. That makes sense. That makes sense. It's got a decent amount of a thinny mini flavor. It's mm -hmm. probably what helped to um add to the color. Yeah, but it's not overbearing. Sense. It's that like delicious. Tart. Thinny mini. Thinny is the first thing you taste. And a little bit alcoholic. That actually, that actually sounds and looks delicious. Yum. Yeah, very nice. Yum, even more. It's alcoholic because I've had it for so long already, it's starting to ferment. Ferment, But that's gotcha. okay. Yay, food. It just means I need to eat it. Ooh, we have a new view. I'm going to turn on Minx's oh, stream on my wow. side. Look at that. So that I could switch that up too. There we go. Now I can hear the music finally. A quick close up of the sweet be caramel. Oh, yeah. That looks good. You don't need to use brown sugar. It's a it's kind of a, a hack. It's a bit of a cheat for making something that tastes like caramel. You don't need to caramelize the, the sugar nearly as much because of the brown sugar from from the molasses 
and everything's right. dissolved nicely. I didn't really need to worry about incorporating the molasses uh, because um, nature took its course. <laughs> this is a very consistent watery molasses brown sugar mixture. Um, in a while, I'll bring this to a boil, add some butter to it, add some vanilla extract, let it hang out for a bit, and uh, magic happens. A pinch of salt always goes okay. a long way. I'm just bringing the oil here up to temperature. I was going to say very quickly, a good quality thermometer is your friend. You really, 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 really should have an accurate thermometer. I still need to get a replacement for my oven probe. Uh, especially if you're doing steaks, just to know what temperature you should be pulling things out at. I don't like going for for uh, poking. I don't like going by feel. I know it works. I'm comfortable doing it. I just don't like doing it, especially when we have, you know, science. We do indeed have science. As well, um, different cuts of steak feel differently, and it's a lot to learn for people that aren't trained or have the experience of cooking steaks in that manner. So it's better to have the safety of uh, digital heat. And then. for those not on a commercial oh, break, you can see the oil is shimmering a little bit. That's why you can't hear me. It's a good indication the oil is ready to uh, for frying. Or you can pull out your laser thermometer. Don't test your oil by splattering water in it. Uh, I mean, as hilarious as it is, it's a little dangerous. Don't do it. And the last bit of frying trivia. I find it safest to, even with, with something shallow like this, take your meat and just lay it away from you. Because if anything splashes, it's going to splash in that direction, not towards you. I don't care about my stove nearly mm -hmm. as much Thank as I you. care about me not burning myself. Again, I just take my big chunk of meat and I uh, casually just flop it away from me. And things work out uh, just fine. Chef, can you hear me? Is the ad over? The chef, uh, the, uh, the ad is not over yet. No, okay. I'm watching it on my mobile. I just wanted to get, I just wanted to get a time link with him. Um, my dish should be ready in about seven or eight minutes. And I suspect based on his pan frying and the thinness of the chicken, it should be done within a matter of five minutes. He's just got to re deep fry after that, I believe. Yeah, he gave the thumbs up. Just imagine Minx like one of those people in Cold Tuck Yeah. Of oil that's uh, heating up. And as soon as the chicken is done, I will bring the oil up to temperature and I will quickly assemble everything and then I'm basically done. That's good. My baking should be completed in about seven minutes, so we should be roughly on time. Mix, where does that put us on total? He, uh, Just kind of terrifying, right? It's quarter past nine for me, which is how it is for you. You are at 4 18 a.m. Yep. Yeah, I, I expected it to be about an hour and a half uh, this thing, so that's good. Glad we're on time. What are you eating now? Oh, you went back to your apple. It's a bit brown now. I went back to my apple. I'm watching him use his laser thermometer. So fun fact about those things that I learned recently with a lot of technical issues with our flat top is those tend to be off by upwards of 25 degrees. What? Really? Yeah. Yeah. Is it like a brand then thing? It's a brand thing. It's also uh, just a technical thing. It has to do with the way that it receives its information from the light from the light source. It it just doesn't read as accurately as say a temperature probe or a direct stick probe that he was using earlier. Interesting. Still, probably yeah, we've we've been having problems enough. with our flat top. Oh really? I was gonna say, but surely, I mean, hmm. For his purposes, it's accurate enough. The way I can see the 
Yeah, I was going to say, it's probably it accurate is, enough. Oh, look at that. Yeah, it looks so good. The grease in his, the grease in his uh, oil looks, what am I saying? The grease in his pan looks really nice. Um, it's bubbling very healthily. Um, he's getting a crunchiness he showed on the bottom. It hasn't quite started to caramelize the sugars in the um, flour yet, but he's getting there. And these almost look like, right now, fish cutlets for whatever reason for me. Yeah. But yeah, they look yeah. really nice. It's the flour. It gives a soft um, visual texture to the chicken. Visual texture. <laughs> yes. Can you not point out my wankiness? I was really proud of that sentence. No, because you made me think of the word fishes, like a violent fish. <laughs> Vicious texture. <laughs> <laughs> Use that next time Koi's being grumpy. I will. Koi, you have a vicious texture right now. <laughs> well, he said, if it's shiny, temperature reading becomes super hard. Yeah, that also is a factor. Um, Drax is asking, wait, Wolfie, if I heated up pasta in the microwave and put cheese on it, does that make me a chef? It makes me mad at you. <laughs> yeah. But a home chef is a home chef regardless. If you're making food, you're making food, and that's really all that matters. As long as you like it, in spite of how painful it might be to classically trained or even well-trained chefs like uh, Blouse. Um, yeah, as long as you enjoy it. It's really don't interesting show me. Um, in Australia. There's someone called Maggie Bear who is a very famous self-proclaimed cook um, and has has gotten to the point where has been on MasterChef, like is very well recognized, um, mm -hmm. but doesn't give herself the title just because just she wasn't classically trained. But it's interesting because it means in Australia compared to overseas, the term cook doesn't have a bias against it. It's really interesting. Whereas overseas, um, if if you don't say that you're a chef, you're just kind of presuming like a cook is considered to be like not not very skilled, like just very everyday. And so people have the title because you need to recognize the amount of work that they put in. So I just I find it really fascinating because in Australia we don't have the bias just because Maggie Bear made home cooking such a massive thing and, and kept the title despite deserving the title for her studies. Um, and, and so people, people are quite fine with being called cooks. It's really interesting. I, I can say that I am of the same mind. I don't particularly consider myself a chef because I do not have the range of expertise that some of the chefs I've worked for have and the, uh, the, the sheer range of knowledge. Mm -hmm. Um, I, I always believe that there's more to learn there's more to build upon, always more to modify. And mm -hmm. I, while I, while I am known as Chef Wolfie on here, I don't see myself in that footing yet um i am working my way up there but at the same time i am in the same mind as um i forgot her name already chef barry uh, uh, Ma Ma maggie maggie bear it, 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 it's 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 beer but it's pronounced bear thick maggie bear um i believe that everybody who puts in the effort and the time to create something for themselves is a chef because it doesn't i could have i could have gotten as far as i have without going to school just like she did and i honestly feel like my schooling was a waste of time and money um <laughs> it's, yeah. just, it's much more accurate to say that i learned everything on the job than i learned anything in school yes she drax wolfie's gonna have the best beard i've ever seen now it's so funny because chef plus actually had I dare say, okay, I'm not going to say better, on par beard, so everyone is happy. I've had a sexy beard out there. But he shaved it for a face reveal of um his three-year Twitch anniversary. So every time I see him at the moment, like it, his logo is currently sitting down next to ours, but every time I see him at the moment, I'm like, look at it. I just kind of want to like slap his cheeks. <laughs> He's got no beard at the <laughs> moment. I don't know why. I don't know why that. It's still weird for me to, yeah, every time I see it, I'm like, oh, yeah, where'd it go? Ah, uh, 
That looks really good. And something to pay attention to that you can kind of see with how he's trying to chicken over, if you're using a um, a coil burner like that, is there will tend to be more heat towards the center. You can see there's more browning on that front, more chicken breast, because that one was sitting closer to the center, whereas the one on the outside is slightly less brown. And that's true even if you have a gas burner with like a really tiny flame, like mine. That's why I use small pans on it usually. Mock's always going on that he wishes we had an induction cooktop. Hey, suck. average. Oh, you think they suck? Wow, that's official. Yep. That's official. I fully, I fully think they suck. Mock, are you in the chat? That's the end of that. <laughs> the reason being... The reason being is they only work with specific style kinds of pans. Yeah, they do. And even specific shapes of pans. So you have to buy like particularly oh, induction yeah. baked or induction appropriate materials. Our oven is slanted because forward slightly. Oh, you know what? Now that you've said it, I can see it with the uh, the grease. Yeah, it's like all at the front, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, no. I think it's pan hooked up in the middle. It's so clean as well. <laughs> ah, attack of the killer tongs. I liked that it was kind of slowly working towards you in the bottom corner as well. No, Hi. we not are my apple. Doing good, average. We are um almost there with the revealing of both chefs, Monte Cristos, and uh, it's been very chill. We we had technical issues as is tradition. Oh, look at that. Nice. Um Yeah, it's it's always very hard. Like to put into perspective, it's is very hard for a guest to come into someone else's setup as well. Like Chef has a very particular setup. I, I love his streams. I please again um linked in the title and, and in the pin right now. Please go give Chef a follow. Huge supporter of our channel. From the very beginning, it's it's been really sweet of him, um, and 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 Nuvo in the chat as well is is also a DJ. I enjoy popping in and listening to her music as well. It's really hard to come in on someone else's setup and not have technical issues and and everything goes smoothly. So I always really appreciate when guests kind of pop in and collab with us, especially with really complicated setups like like cameras and cooking and everything going everywhere. It's uh, it's much harder on them than on us. So thank you, thank you for being forgiving of our, our internet internet troubles. I just still can't get over how clean your oven is. That is that is that is white. <laughs> oh, of course. Is this are we getting really close to the deep fry? I can't I'm really excited about this, but it's gonna be ridiculous. It's back, it's back from the bedroom. The waffle of love. You do your best? I love it. I have, I have you on in the background when I can. Now that chicken is not in the bin, it's just gently resting. It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> oh yeah, I want that, thank you. Bit of a clean rake? Oh, you mean the oven? this is all you? Wow, this is amazing. Please come to my house. <laughs> these types of ovens are so hard to keep clean as well. I remember at one flat we had these and they were just like, oh. Yeah, you got to keep on it. She chef knows what's up. He's got some foil underneath the coils. Yeah. I got that chick off my mom. Like, she has paper towels under everything. It's like, you got a fruit bowl, paper towel under it. Doesn't matter what it is, paper towel under it. <laughs> Average, today I accidentally planted an entire bamboo forest around my mate's house in Minecraft. Perfect. What a beautiful surprise when they wake up. Accidentally. Should be using the burner covers, though. Grease gets all over the elements. Right. Yeah, I suppose that's true, huh? Oh, so is this, this is I more done. batter on top? 
What? Oh. Uh, I'm not looking at you. I'm not looking at you. Did you just say don't look? <laughs> yeah, don't look. I'm not done. I mean, I'm at a healthy 120 degrees. You, you're in the bottom left anyway. People can see you, but okay. No, don't look. You, you're like me before I finish prepping stuff. I'm like, don't look at it yet. Stop it. I'm not ready. My, my temperature should reach by the time Chef is done with this. Yeah, the glue? Lovely That's what I was noticing. That's so clever. Waffles? Yeah, average. I'm getting so hungry. I, I always do this. I always pre-order. Where's my food? Let me check. Oh, it's here. I'm going to go get it soon. I always pre-order food so that I always get hungry on these streams. And so as soon as they finish, I can go eat. You just ain't night hungry again? Yeah, these these streams are very hard to get through without being hungry. It's true. Well, I snack sometimes during them, like my apple. I was looking forward to watching this bit. Oh my god. And then it ding dropped in. Oh, this is crazy. This is crazy. Look at it. Yes, do it. There it goes. Nice. Oh, you can see you can see Mixed, it bubbling. Uh, it's good. Hydrate. It's good. Huh? Hydrate. Oh, hydrate. Thank you. You haven't said it at all, so I didn't figure anybody would be bit. Daisy, thank you so much for the raid. Hello, everyone. Welcome. We are doing a collab with Chef Blouse, which is linked in the title and in the pin right now. And Chef Wolfie, every Saturday, we do cooking streams. The rest of the day, we're a variety channel. The seven of us co-host different, different games on different days. Today, they're doing a Monte Cristo challenge, and you're watching the last little bit. You are watching a waffle chicken sandwich being deep fried <laughs> and chef wolfie's version is currently in the oven which is more of a cordon bleu kind of style how are you guys going what were you what were you playing yeah yeah this is like oh my god look at floats as well <laughs> deep frying a sandwich it's all floaty i love it oh, it's crazy Oh boy, this guy's gonna have a nap after this. Daisy, because you're a, a Doom fan, I'm gonna mention it. When we reach 400 followers, we're going to do a special stream of Doom's mum coming in. Look at that, that's amazing! We're four followers away at the moment, so we're hoping to make it happen for Mother's Day. You think you think Doom's cute? Wait till you see Doom's mum, the two of them together. Yeah, Mama Doom! Yeah! So, so we're, cr we're crossing our fingers. I love her. So, so if anyone's in the chat, I, I hate begging for this kind of stuff. Only follow if you want to, obviously. But if you'd like to follow and haven't yet, please do. Because when we reach 400 followers, we're at four away. We're uh, we're going to do a, a Mama Doom special. The batter and was it's just a so touch good. too thick. Sorry, I flipped the fan. The batter was just a touch too thick. So I'm adding a tablespoon of water to the batter. I'm going to put a thinner batter on this. Because I want the dimple texture to show through. Ah, right. okay, that makes sense. Yeah, I get it. Um, everyone, excuse the internet issues on Chef's ah. side at the moment. It's uh, because it also helps you soak up more syrup. That makes sense. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, I'm really sorry for the internet issues at the moment. It, it's what we were chatting about earlier. It's hard when people collab and come in because they're coming into our setup, obviously, not us into theirs. So I really appreciate Chef coming on today and joining us. But it does mean we're having occasional internet issues. But Chef, luckily, is really amazing at talking through things so you can still hear everything. Is this... What was the red cut? I missed it. That Calliope <laughs> music's really going off too. Da, da, da. No, it's very professional. 
We got two professionals on, which is, is exciting. <laughs> You, know, you want to see unprofessional content. This is what's Wolfie eating now. I'm not eating anything right now. Leave me alone. There you go. That was a special behind the scenes sneak peek. <laughs> Back right off. Go away. Leave me alone. <laughs> I am eyeing that orange. Right. right now I'm just re-filtering my butter because I got a little bit of bread crumbs in it when I was fixing that thing earlier. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. I'm so excited. Drop it in. Yes. And As you saw Chef's plate, but he set it in point. sideways so that if any splash occurred, it would not be occur on him. Yes. I want to do this sizzle, sizzle. special shout out so I can see Minecraft. For shizzle. I have kept my oil at 350 Fahrenheit. So hopefully this is all good. Looks good to me. Those you In general, when you're playing with oil, you need to keep it at the right temperature, and you, you usually need more oil than you think you do. You never want to overwhelm the oil with a, a big block of cold or room temperature uh, food, because it, it can shock the, te the oil and bring the temperature down. If you're frying something yeah. at a high temperature, it becomes nice and crisp and beautiful things happen. If you try to cook something in room temperature oil, it just gets gross and soggy. Really oily. Thank you. So this is going to be about three minutes aside. Give it a little. I want this a little darker. I didn't describe it before, but I used a little bit of the waffle batter to act as a glue between the waffles and the chicken. I didn't load the chicken up with anything. There's no extra cheese. There's no bacon. So this is the uh, the diet version. This is the, the tight exceptionally version of low calorie version, meal. which might still be over two. It's over two thousand calories. Who am I kidding? This meal is ridiculous. <laughs> it's exactly what I expect to yeah. see while listening to French music. You guys, for the for Daisy Pearl that raided in, if you're not following Daisy, please drop her a follow. She's a very chill streamer as well. Very cute. I love watching her content. And was playing Minecraft and has a really beautiful server that she runs for all of her little movies. So please yeah, go check out. Yeah, I caught her on the other day and it was, it was very impressive. Very nice looking. Right? Yeah. We're, we're, we're secret Minecraft fans over here we don't we don't i don't think we've ever secret. streamed oh no i did i did briefly briefly stream with um someone else's server but um we play it a lot in the background yeah i was gonna yeah, say no, I you're not sick i mean i fucking love my friend. yeah yeah you're very open about it i've been playing that game since i was 18 it's a nice looking waffle sandwich. It is, isn't it? This might You're be playing a Minecraft right well, now. But I love the cooking mug. You love the cooking one? Yeah, I'm not surprised. Mods, yeah, yeah. Can't do it anymore. I'm hungry. I'm getting my food out. Do it. Go get your food, Minx. We'll be here to distract it's them. It's here. It's here. It's here. I'm just going to, like, take mouthfuls in between. Just just one quick one. <laughs> look, 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 we'll make it a bit more. Now, this, this kind of goes to the, the conversation I was having with the um, one of the tattoo artists the other day. What is on my cutting board? Um, yesterday. I say the, for Americans, I say the other day to me any day that isn't today. I don't care that it's not a yesterday thing. Um, but 
uh, I was discussing like ancient creatures and dinosaurs and stuff because that's one of my passions. And um, they were like, I don't think you're in the right career. I said, no, no, I have a hobby and I have a passion. Like there's a difference. The hobby is the dinosaur. <laughs> Uh, let's go. Cool. My temperature now. Here we go. Oh, it's look at that molasses. Right Time to finish off the syrup. I'm going to raise the temperature on this. Hopefully, we can see inside. Good, good. About how long do you think on your syrup, Jeff? Special interest is great. Does it mean you have to profit off it, though? That's why I only program spam. Uh, exactly. That's good. Minutes, that should be enough time for the chicken, then. I'm at, I'm at a nice 140 degrees, nice mid rib chicken. Five minutes. Yep. Once the About syrup comes to a boil, we'll... you uh, reduce it to medium heat, cook it for another four minutes. That's when I whisk in my butter and flavoring, which is right about now. Whenever you add something to melted sugar, be very careful because this stuff is stupidly hot. It's very easy to burn yourself with melted sugar. And this is one of my yeah. <sighs> technically more dangerous recipes. You should really measure mm -hmm. your stuff in advance, especially when it's flammable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sugar especially will create very, very painful and long-lasting burns if you get it on you. The in I'm fact, the very worst thing you could do. Cup. Oh. oh my goodness, Daisy! Welcome back. That might that might start to foam as well. This is where the danger comes in because that the water from the um uh from the butter kid release and cause the sugar to puff up. Um, but no, one of the worst things you can do if you if you get sugar on you is wipe it off because you could wipe your skin away. It's better to just immediately get it under cold water. I think it's my natural instinct as well. It's most human's <laughs> natural instinct to get the thing off of them, but it's not something you want Sugar's to Sugar is all sorts of dangerous. Yeah. Oh, no, I mean shove it under cold water because I just want the burning to stuff oh. on cold. That's my instinct. But I get scared of if it's cold, does it um, blanch it? Um, it's better than wiping away the flesh. The, the smaller burn that you'll receive is way better than removing skin. And Daisy, same here. I shove whatever body part in my mouth, depending what I burnt myself with. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, just something cooler. Although, don't burn well, your once tongue. Once the butter is fully incorporated, <laughs> yeah, then you have to cook it for one more minute, remove it from heat. And after that, I'm just going to uh, whisk it every minute or so, just to make sure that this, the milk solids that are trying to run away on me stay incorporated. Yep, what he's, what he's doing is a process called mounting where he's adding butter to his final mixture. It's something that we do whenever we make like a demi-glaze sauce or uh, any yeah, number of brown and white sauce. Already foamed away. It adds yeah. a lot of really nice flavor and umami and caramelization. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh, my yard. Yes, my yard. Oh, yeah. Old butter is a really interesting thing for sauces, too, because you can make an emulsion out of basically anything if you're careful when with the type of fat and how you add it. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Pan drippings, deglaze your pan, um, your pot, whatever has those bits of fond, the, the bits of stuck flavor. 
And then once you build up your, your sauce, you can throw in your uh, chunks of butter, whisk that together, and then it just builds up this very velvety, very creamy, uh, beautiful sauce. Okay, what's it called yep. when you add the lumps? Which you can't do if you just pour melted butter in. It's called mounting. Mounting. Lumps. Lumps, yeah. Yeah, chunks of butter. Um, yeah, yeah it is. In, in cooking, we call it mounting, and it does. Mounting it has a very sense. nice velvety look. It looks, it looks a lot that's like. That's what you do for mounting, yeah, I guess. <laughs> mm-hmm. Sometimes you just gotta mount. Um, it, it adds a, it adds a, a sheen to it that's a lot like uh, cornstarch. Um, it makes it look very pretty. But it also has a lot of good flavor. <laughs> We're over the countertop now. Oh, I love his plate. I used to have a glass bowl like that I would eat cereal out of, and then one day it exploded. Oh my god. Mm, yes. Nice basting. Fine chicken should be ready as well. They look so good. Oh, we're doing the cut open. Yeah, gotta get that reveal. Here we go. I was just gonna say I failed. I should have cut it on an angle. Nah, nah, nah. It looks good. It looks good. It's Chicken fine. reveal. Nice. If we leave it there, eventually the pixels will clear up and I'll get a shot of it later. Chicken waffle waffle, a.k.a. the blocos. That looks ridiculously delicious. It looks heart-wrenchingly painful in a good way. So what's going on over here? So I've taken mine out of the oven and I'm giving mine the lovely cut, very warm. You with someone with glaze you like that? <laughs> the bond blouse. <laughs> and we have our lovely internals. Good as well. Right? They both look amazing. I have crumbs everywhere. I hate this. Am I going to be able to do a screenshot oh, yeah. today? Oh, maybe. Oh. Okay. You need to do a screenshot, Minx? We'll see, we'll see if I can do it without issues. Okay, everyone, everyone bear with me. Come, come, come back. <laughs> my, lighting, my lighting is terrible. My pixels are terrible. Not nah, my pixels are terrible, but look, look, we'll grab it. We'll grab it the best we can. There you go. I can take a picture and send it you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take a picture. <laughs> my pixels were like, no. <laughs> Got any more of those pixels, bruh? There you go. I sent it to you. Both creations look amazing. That looks amazing. It does. It does. You guys have made me very, very hungry. <laughs> that is what we go for. What was that? That was Chef leaving, I think. I'm not sure if on purpose. Let me... Uh... That, that. Hang on a second. Uh, where is? That's fine because my 
chicken sandwich is actually slightly under. I can see that. Are you going to pop it back in? Yeah, I'm just going to give it a little bit more time. What time are we on, by the way, Minx? Uh, The time for you is... 4.49? 4.50am. Yeah. Hello, welcome back. Hi, back, Jeff. Hello, welcome to the bathroom. Uh, bad thing is I'm now hungry and I ate dinner not too long ago. Yeah, this this is this is me. I'm about to Uber food because of this. Yep. Welcome, welcome yep. to my world. This is this is what I deal with every Saturday. <laughs> I've learnt the trick now. Is you got to get yourself food before you join our cooking streams. It's um. Honestly, I love that. I love hearing that though, because I'm making. We're making things that are appetizing into the teacher palate. Makes you yeah. You need to do that. That's true. That's really true, actually. Jeff and I creating two lovely creation in a creative way the entire goal so you, you popped it back in didn't you you were like oh no no yeah mine was i mine was my i think i need to recalibrate my probe because it told me that i was 157 which no is not 164 but there's something called carryover cooking i was going to let it sit and continue to cook as it's set but yeah. it looked a little too pink for me um it was close but or being open, it wasn't where I wanted it. So I'm just going to give it another five, six minutes. Okay. Uh, but, um... We're going to be safe today. No poison. Poison? Cusco's poison. Poison Cusco. Uh, I'm trying to lose weight. This is just teasing. Daisy, my life. As as the famous muddled films would say, me when. Me when. <laughs> Spartans off to play Dragon Age. You take a break from The Witcher. I'm hoping we'll get back I'm into back. Dragon Age on the weekend. Hello, welcome, welcome back. Welcome back, Jeff. Are you eating that delicious creation? He's already gone into a coma. <laughs> yeah, he's just drooling in the background. See, so my metabolism is, metabolism is fast. No, I, I haven't uh, haven't touched my Nuvo's uh, behind me uh, munching. <laughs> Uh, haven't touched my Nuvo's uh, behind me uh, munching. Oh, Nuvo's doing the munching, huh? I've lost word capacity, sorry. Oh, let's get you back. Oh, hang on, let me, let me, let me get you back on. Um... Yeah, my, I expected um, about 20 to 25 minutes, but due to the extra insulation the bread is providing, it's making, um, look at the handsome man, it's making my, uh, yeah, it's making the chicken a little, little longer to take cooking. So we, we've got it back in the oven, chef, to finish off because it's a little too pink for me. Now, now we have a yeah, corner. it's always tough to gauge cooking time uh, with meats when you have uh, inconsistent things wrapping around it. Yeah, absolutely. A, pre a breast itself, I could have immediately assumed 15 minutes to right the money, but just cooking everything and then assemble it and then just finish it yeah, in the absolutely. oven. But right. that's why we use these. 
seems like assembling Lego that way, you know, if everything's pre-cooked and you're just finishing it in the oven. Uh, that's, that's why we use these. Seems like assembling Lego that way, you know. Here we go. Corner chef. <laughs> ba, 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 ba. We can decide what we're doing we're doing after this as well. I'm guessing are you are you gonna go back to bed? Place that bad boy in half under the salamander. Two mm. minutes you're done, right? Yeah, no kidding. I wish I had a salamander. I mean, I guess I kind of have one with this grill. I could always use the royal top, but. The dream. I wish I had a flat top. That's my dream. But I got a nice big skillet. That makes up for it. I, I will not have the time to do video games mix after this. I'm going to go straight to getting ready for work. Yeah, you're gonna uh, work. So I got a half an hour before I gotta leave. You get it. And I don't think we'll find quite an as exciting and short a game as lobster whatever that was. <laughs> what was that? We usually try to find games afterwards that are to do with what we just cooked. I guess it, uh, there might be a sandwich maker out there. <laughs> oh, I I know for a fact there is. It's there just, is? It means we are. Yeah, there's several. Actually, mm -hmm. Papa's Bur Burger Maker is a good one. If you want, really? like, a shitty Java game to play. Okay, Papa's, Bur Papa's Burgeria, that's what it's called. Papa's Burgeria? Okay, hang on. Let me, uh... Let me pop over my, uh, my Steam. You get if I can find a multiplayer. If uh, Chef wants to stick around, we'll find some silly... Silly game. <laughs> well, if you're going for multiplayer, go with um. Don't you have that cooking game? The one where you run around in the little restaurant. I feel like you and Doom played it at one point. No, I don't think so. Do you mean Overcooked? Yeah, I mean Overcooked. Nah, I uh, I only have that on um Switch, and that's that's Mox. Oh, I remember you mentioning it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, look, look. If I type into Steam sandwich i get knuckle sandwich okay <laughs> <laughs> sandwich sim there is there is a free sandwich sim Holy sandwich shit. sim are you kidding me yes game and then one of those ones where you have to use every letter as a finger and try to build a sandwich i am like uh yeah in the vein of uh, uh the hospital game i can't think of the name of we're gonna play this um in tradition of our really weird streams, I'm gonna find. I wish it was multiplayer. I wonder if I can find one multiplayer. Hang on, wait, wait, wait. That is one to think of. Hang on. So that's that's one. Like I said, the multiplayer one I know of immediately offhand, unfortunately, requires VR, and I don't have my setup right now. Um, it's called um, the Diner Duo. Uh, it's very very fun, in my opinion. One person plays as the server on the PC, and the other person plays as the cook in VR. Um, no, there's there is nothing there is nothing free. So I think I think we're gonna have to. Um... Sorry. That's fine. Are you talking about sandwiches? I'm here wondering if I should play Minecraft. You should get a sandwich. Yeah. If you have hands harvest craft in your mod folders, you can definitely make a lot of sandwiches. I'm on 165. 165. That is our chicken temperature. And that is our non tank delicious chicken. I wish I had better lighting. It looks so good. I can't wait for it to cool down so I can eat it. <laughs> Looks awesome. You gonna you gonna be trade ya? <laughs> yeah, I wish you guys could try each other's. I wish we could. I'm not far away from Canada. I could probably drive out there. 
see if I can download this without killing my internet, shall we? I don't Let's remember. See. No, he's Central Time, so he's like he's very far east from me. Yeah, it's next door, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just right next door. Just, just bring it with next you. It won't me. be soggy. It'll but be only if you're wet. Fine. The bread got just slightly crispy on the outside too, which is what I was looking 30 for. Hour drive away. Thirty dry, thirty hours. Thirty hours. No problems. No problems. It'll be totally. I've fine. driven worse. Uh, I had to stretch my job without I gave myself a muscle problem. What? <laughs> I don't open my mouth that wide that often. So, like, sometimes the muscle that yeah. connects the uh, front of your jaw to your neck tenses up when I open really wide. Oh my god. Okay. All right. Oh, I that's perfect. Good, bro. Yeah. And that's up when I open really Is it that kind of stream yet? Yeah. We're uh, we're getting close, aren't we? Oh my well, god. We're getting there. We're getting that. I've got my mouth on some cock right now. <laughs> how long how long <laughs> you got before work, Wolfie? Are you running for it? About a half hour. Okay. All right. I am I am downloaded this game. So if you guys wanna join us, we have a tradition where we usually go into what we call what the fox, where we, we find free Steam games that are just weird and and i have found sandwich sim and i am <laughs> I'm excited. Um, i will i'm gonna leave on my phone and i will join back on the other side right. if you I have will, my me still up i will see you soon here we go love you all oh i was like the exact wait hold up wait now i'm confused where i was pulling from give me give me a sec give me a sec i think i confused myself this happens a lot, by the way. So we're gonna we're gonna close this. We're gonna switch this. Give me. Is this a multiplayer PvP? I can't find. I can't find a multiplayer. If we can find a multiplayer, I don't, I don't see multiplayer. Hey, will um. Could only find a single player. We can find a Hang on. Let me let me let me try. In this. There we are. We really Miami should get back to bed, way. actually. Do you want to get back to bed? Oh, I just found cookies. But I'll crazy. stick around and watch the silliness. Always Thanks for having me, though. It was a ton of fun. Hell yeah, man. Uh, I to do this again. Out. Here we go. There you are. There you are. I get chef back. I get chef back. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, uh -huh. it's because it's doing this? I see. Or right. the Discord capture app. Didn't use that much better. Ah, uh, he's gone to bed. He's gone to bed, Ben. Sorry. Bye bye. We'll have him in chat, hopefully. Uh let's let's play this weird game. Where are you? That was fun. That was a lot of Where fun. are you? Where are you? Oh, goodness. Yeah, I love that there's a parking lot. There's so much to this already. Out. Another shout out. Here we go. Again. Was it a jack Jackbox? Jeff's very multi talented. Jeff, as, as we call him. DJ also plays <laughs> a lot of good games, a lot of community games. So, if you're into community games, um, a lot of Jackbox and really into Max, which is really cool. And and actually, even if, if you're into Warhammer 40k miniatures, um, I noticed he was doing a, a painting stream the other day. So if you're into miniatures, Hi. also recommend. Good fun. Playing. Hmm. Give me a second, guys. You can't sleep? And I'm so sorry. It's gonna deafen me. Oh, oh god, the game's gonna deafen me. It's the first time I've loaded it, and it's gonna deafen me. And it's Unity. And it's Unity. Angu language idioma.
Um, wait, I was still running live the entire time. No wonder I was having internet issues. Uh... <laughs> Way to go. I like how this already looks like um, a VHS tape. Yeah, let me let me do let me do hang on directly. God, that explains so much. I'm so blonde. Not I closed it. Mm. Uh okay, so sandwichson. Here we go. Hey, let me turn down the audio. I don't know what audio we're gonna get, but uh it's gonna be exciting. Where are you? Sandwichson. There you are. I'm getting nothing right now. Okay. Um, I English, I guess? Oh. There's the music. Is that the stream okay. or the game? No, it's the game. Okay. No, it's the game. I, um, here we go. Alright, so. It resume, Minx. I'm hitting it. Hello and welcome to the Sandwich Sim tutorial. You can walk with WASD and use a mouse when you're ready. Hit space. I, I guess. I guess it, that. Oh, oh, this is it. This is what? <laughs> okay, wait, what? Oh boy. Oh wow, uh, this really that is supposed to be there. <laughs> but you're awesome. Thanks so much for the fun experience. Oh, thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate it. It was so much fun to finally do a collab with you guys. Um, and, and again, let me, let me, let me give oh, this a shout out as well, because, um, behind every chef is, um, someone trying their best to herb cats. Yes, a <laughs> fantastic technical coordinator. <laughs> I know the feeling. I share the pain. I share the pain. Um, while using your hands, you can move them around with your mouse. Okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. While using your hands, you can move them. Yeah, right. We read that's a mushroom. Oh, okay. Hang on, wait. Mushroom. Get, give me mushroom. Get. Oh, okay. What? Grab it. I think you might need to get closer. Pressing shift will allow you to move your hands closer or further away from you. So I think you have to like. I'm pushing shift. Oh, that that happened. Oh. There you go. Oh. There my... you go. Yep. Dude, Just like the... real arms. This is the worst stoner experience in the world. Give me. Where, where is it? Hang on, wait. Where? How? How big is this mushroom? How big is this? Oh, 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 oh! You can see kind of there's a grid. There you go. Back up a little bit. There you go. Yeah. Mushroom. Oh my God! Look at. Oh God. Yeah. Press space to go back into walking mode. Walk over towards the mushroom. Oh. <laughs> You know, I called it that this you would be what? kind of like... We already did that. When you were close, hit space again. And move your hand over it. Okay, look. All right. Okay, look. We did it. We did it. Let's we did it. Grab it. We did it the better way. Whatever. It's fine. I can just... Rotate it. items by Q. Q. Move and E. Rotate. Uh oh Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-oh. That's how arms work. Oh, God. Oh no, no one scaled that mushroom. Look at my hands right now. Right click to toggle between which hand you're using. Oh, we can really grope the mushroom. Oh, right. Uh, you should be ready to prepare a sandwich. Well, no, this is... The last eight hours are a blur. This is about sandwiches, Dozzy. All I remember is brainstorming sandwich oh, recipes. Boy. The details escape me, but I think I wrote it out on my computer. Yeah, that's right. I remember getting ready to print out my grocery list before going to the store. How does one anxiety and chill? They reduce anxiety by chilling. Oh, but also no. just knowing You're... that there is anxiety, but we chill. Essentially that. Welcome, yep. by the way. Grab the computer to interact with it. Okay, sure. Why not? Oh, you have to go my... to the store to get your, your supplies. Oh my god. I have to, like, drag my mouse around. Hang on, wait. How do I grab hey, the computer? To... I hate that VA. Overlay. I'm trying. Glitchy Let nonsense. Let me grab. All right. You have to select a hand, right? Like hit space to stop walking. Oh yeah. Okay. I already forgot. Look at the bears. What's up with the bears? I just want to make sandwiches. <laughs> Sugar bear. Level one, two, three, four, five, and six. 
there was a singular sunbat deemed unworthy of living in the wild, a food conglomerate bought him and began testing its products on it. They forced it to ingest high concentrations of sugar to the point that the bear's intelligence became severely impaired and could not operate something as simple as a liver as the bear's brain deteriorated so did its resistance and blah 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 blah. It's gone. This is... Very fast. Wait, what? So he escaped from prison? There in the entrance hovered a swarm of bees? He roared. They responded. He went up to them as they buzzed around and nodded. And nodded? Sometimes they could understand each other's needs and wants. For now, they shared one singular goal. Get out. This, are you playing what? the bear game? You are playing the bear I'm, game. I don't want to play a bear game. Wait, hold up. Wait, I don't want to play a bear game. Oh my god, can you hear the buzzing? I, no. I just hear the thumping. <laughs> no. Grocery list. Two tomatoes, one loaf of bread, one hunk of lettuce, one chunk of cheese, one pickle. Print. Okay. No meat. Recipe. Heavenly sandwich. Ingredients. Bread, lettuce, pickle, tomato, cheese, mushroom, underlined, sauce. Okay. Slice every ingredient. Place a bread slice on the plate. Add a slice of each ingredient. Finish with sauce and a slice of bread. Eat and enjoy. Okay. All right. Okay. Email from Barry. Where's the sandwich? I don't know, I figured that out. Yeah. Poor bear. <laughs> Hello, Jacob. Thank you for the leg. Um, okay, alright. No, fuck you, Barry. We don't care about you. Hang on, wait. Yes, we love bourbon, chef. Yes. Oh my god, the movement is so full on. Okay. I wanna... What? I got it. Yes! Okay, alright, we're getting there, we're getting... Tomato, tomato, bread, lettuce, pickle, cheese. Uh... How do I? Okay, is it in here? Hang on. Oh my god. No, you gotta leave. You gotta go to the store. I gotta go to the store? Yeah, that's a grocery list. Oh my god. All right. Okay. Do I? You have do to I... venture off into the wide, realistic world. Do I close my door? Hang on. Wait. 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 Uh, uh, yeah. No. It looks like you live in a pretty safe neighborhood. Um, I can't see through my giant hand. Hang on. Okay. Oh, grocery. There's the store. Oh no. Do I have to play Frogger? You have to play a really tight frogger by the looks of it. Look at this. Look at all this land. This is so... Wow, Hello. it's so realistic. Oh my god, the people. Does this say sand? No, I can't. <laughs> oh. 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 Am, I, am I a bear? I'm a bear. Okay. okay hang on, no, you're a ping pong ball. Oh my god. I am never going to do this. And then I have to get back afterwards? Are you kidding? Oh. Is there a crossing? Gotta be careful. Nope. I'm just gonna yellow it. I'm just gonna yellow Don't it. Make it happen. Wait. Do you think? Okay. Do you think I can stop midway? Wait. Hang on. Oops. No. Yeah. There's okay. a middle. There's definitely there's a, middle, a middle, middle there. There's a middle point, right? Hang on. Wait. 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 Okay. Yep. Just sidestep them. You got this. This is oh, easy. God damn it. There's a lot of blood on that third car. I don't know if you noticed that. I mean, that's understandable with the way I'm going. Oh my god, yeah, there really is. Okay, 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 hang on. What happens if I get all the groceries and then... Oh my god, I don't like this. Oh! Ah! Oh my god. Oh, you made it! I did not. <laughs> Dude, okay, hang on. Okay, hang on. This is so... Oh my god, you're really fast! Sure they're ah. okay, this game on. just became so unrealistic. What the hell? I just want a sandwich! Just now. I just want a sandwich. You think it's a break? Oh my god. Okay. No! Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna. Fucking hell. You. You. Oh my god. You. Okay, hang on. I have to like drag okay, okay. my mouse around. Okay, hang on. The there is go. a break with the red. Yeah, oh god. I feel like there was a break that did say Hamlin. Maybe there isn't. Am I imagining it? No, I'm imagining it. I can't imagine. See? Oh 
Oh my god, the blue cars. Are they going slow? Are they going slow? It's fine, right? This is it. Oh, oh my god. I think I'm a bear. You are a bear. Hello. Okay. I. Oh, yes. Give me that. Okay. I. Okay. So, tomato, tomato. Fantastic. Oh, fuck. This chef, this this That's grocery store solid. sells exactly what you need. We have locked the doors behind you. What? If you wish to exit the building, simply add everything you me... want to your shopping basket. Thanks to me... the power of cookies and targeted yeah, ads, but... we know exactly what you want. We also have your <laughs> credit card. Oh my god, okay. So as you walk so, so... So what? What? <laughs> no, I don't want soup, I want to buy. So... What? What? I don't know, it keeps making me have soup. Why? I just want tomato. Do I have to find the tomato? Are you kidding me? Soup. I mean, they did say they know exactly what you soup. want. Soup. Soup. I don't want soup. I want soup. tomato. I want soup. tomato. I want... I want tomato. Soup. Soup. Oh, oh, it's a tomato! Oh, a tomato! Okay, hang on. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Okay, I'm just putting it here for the moment. Okay, hang on. We're dropping it here. The one to my day. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where you keep your vegetables on the floor. I am. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna use your egg. Soup. No. no. God damn it. Is that a tomato? Wait. Soup. No. Soup. I was thinking no. the same thing, chef. Just like scoop the bitch up. So. You only need one tomato, I don't know why. No, I need two! It says two! Thank you. <laughs> what are you doing at the soup store? I don't know! It said sandwich simulator! I get, you I'm so can't confused. get pants at the soup store. I just wanted to make a sandwich like you guys. Okay, hang on, wait, hang on. Uh, uh, stop. Oh my god, the controls are so... Yes. No! 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 Uh, average gamer, she's... No. ...shopping. And... She's gathering soup. Soup. Makes us trying her hardest to make a sandwich <gasps> like I <laughs> Chef did. There's another <laughs> tomato. Oh, give it, give it, give it, fine, wait. Okay. 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 About just no. how surprised oh, you are to get god. the right thing. Oh my god. Hang on. Wait, 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 wait. You got it. There you go. That's how I hold tomatoes. I jam my fingers through the center of it. Stay. Stay! Oh god, alright. Hang on. What's up, Wanted? Wait. What the hell? Okay. Fine, whatever. Why is it? Okay, have oh. fun, gamer. Uh, uh, yes. Nailed it. Oh god, all this stuff is. Why is there all this <laughs> stuff attached to it? Oh my god. Okay, you you might have to, like, become one entity. I don't know if you could take off pieces. Oh, you can, okay. Okay. Oh my god. I just yes. Good sweet rotation. Yes. Come here. And then There you go. There you go. Is it Almost. Oh Okay. I don't think was that the other tomato? No, that's the I other tomato. I think you tomato. should clean off your cart real quick. I think if I do that it's gonna I think it's gonna Oh my god. <laughs> that one TF2 video about soup. Yes, that's so old school. Um, I oh, now. Oh <laughs> I'm in the grocery store with you. I agree, Chef. I have never felt more realistic in my life. I, I too generally walk with one of my arms raised above my head in the sun blocking position. It's like Balancing a performing my... magic. Okay, why, why, why are these soup things attached? Why? Hang on. Come here. Go away. It's a neat trick, especially that one floating above it. Oh, thank God. Okay, go away. No, I just want. Hang on, wait. I just want. Oh my God. Just, just, yeah, soup. just. Nope. Okay, yes. Okay, all right, all right, all right, okay. Bread. Is this bread? Okay, it's bread. Oh, it's not gonna be bread, is it? 
Oh my god, it's just bread? Okay, 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 okay. All right, okay, okay. Hot okay. damn. Holy I hope shit. to God you pick the one good one and the rest of them right? fuck you over. I will, uh... They have it! And bread! Okay, okay. Yes! I'm a genius. Shall I pick up the others? Do you want me to say? Hang on. Just, just to be on, yeah, just to be on the safe side. Nope, it it's all bread. actual bread. It is actual bread. Okay, bread, lettuce. Little do you realize they're painted rocks. Oh, sorry. God, the way I have to, like, drag my my mouse over, like... Oh uh, my god. Uh, uh, <laughs> they, look, yeah. they look like bowling balls. Okay, we get Also, I've never seen lettuce shaped lettuce. like that. I think I've got severe after this. If I go through all this and then I cross back and I die and it doesn't respawn me with my food, I'm quitting. I'm just saying right now. <laughs> like, Sylvie says. I can just, just straight up quitting. Sylvie says, as a human, I can confirm this is exactly what being a human is like. Yeah, 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 100%. Oh, look, there's more bread. Okay, hang on. Pickle. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Pickles. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. I'm hoping that being locked in the store and preferably being locked outside of the store uh, ends up being a checkpoint because she has to start this over from the road. For I, 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 I will quit. Okay, okay. Um, there's my dildo. Mm -hmm. Okay, done. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. Cheese. Pickle. I don't know, Mix. That one didn't cross pickle off the list when you picked it up. It did. It says oh, pickle. Oh, yeah, it did. There we go. There we go. Oh, my God. Don't panic me. About my pickles. Apparently, it doesn't cross it off till it's in your basket. All right, now clearly Swiss cheese. Nothing. Clearly. It could be possibly nothing else. Okay. okay. Why would I want to pick up all that soup as well? Stop it. Hang on. Oh no, it's including it. No, I want you to go away. Go away. Like leave me alone. Okay. You fine. like. Okay, fine. You like eat it to the other side of the store. Fine. We're just. It's just all coming. Whatever. No! Oh my god. Um. There you go, just shove it in the ground. Make it not up here anymore. There's not gonna be like... Go away. I swear to god if it's falling. Look, if it follows me behind, whatever. Yeah. Goodness, okay. I can't wait. Uh, uh. Okay, I'm getting slowly faster. Eh. I love this mouse sensitivity oh. to it. I can clearly see you having to drag all the way across your desk. <laughs> like, just to turn a cord away. I'm like, please. Please. Okay, okay. Wait, come here. Let me. Let me soap. Okay. Alright. Why do I feel like. Oh, okay. Alright. Okay. Hang on. And then. Okay. Alright. This is it. FBI, okay. freeze! What? Why? Oh, hey no. guys, we're here with the Federation of Bread and Ingredients, and Excuse we have me? reason oh, no. to believe that you are preparing to assemble a sandwich me? that will threaten the profits of agribusiness. Excuse me? Wait, no, well? I was supposed to say threaten democracy or liberty or something. What? Yeah, let's get out of there. Away. What? Good thing it doesn't know how to navigate that obstacle course our agents have trapped it in. I, well, it's not that complex. I just want to make a sandwich. What do you mean? I just Using want to... W. To jump is unintuitive w. <laughs> when it hasn't been able to jump what? all game long. Yeah, I guess <laughs> S to duck would only make sense if there was some kind of tutorial oh. or exposition. Okay. The one straightforward part is holding A and D to move into the left or right lanes respectively. Okay. Well, no use in the... The other agents, mm, they've got this. They are so smooth. It looks like they are phasing through the yeah, obstacles. Just eat him. He's my new well, sandwich. The bear dropped the basket. Right. Sun bears aren't friendly. Can you just can you take the you basket back to my house? No, take it back to my yeah, house so I can make a that sandwich. Be fine. No. no way the bear would even remember to find its way back over here. Are you even kidding? if it did escape. No. Yeah. Oh. By the way, do you ever feel like something about us is off? He, oh. No. Everything about me sun makes bears. sense. And everything I do and say is what a normal, real person would do. Oh my god, no. Okay. Uh. <laughs> yep. No, oh, oh, I gotta hold it, I gotta hold it, I gotta hold it. Oh. Ah. Duck, duck, duck. No! <laughs> okay, 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 hold. Uh, I don't think Goodness. it matters. Okay, alright. We're catching you. Okay. This music is intense. Yeah, follow the beat. 
I can't believe we get to play another Endless Runner. Oh, there he oh. goes. Wait. Oh, no! Not Where's gonna go my sandwich! Where'd the ham come from? Oh, okay, 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 okay. We don't have to, like... It doesn't let me, like, pre-move either. Subway Surfer. Either. Okay. I just called it Subway Surfer. Subway Surfer's actually really funny. Okay. Okay, where am I? There you go. You good, you good? Yep. You got this. Look at that skill. Ow! Oh, come on. You made it! Hey. Avoid him. Yes! I... Get the heart. Oh no, oh no, I can't! How do I... Ah! Ah! I I'm know. right click! I got that right! No! This is to roll boulder for all eternity. I now sentence oh, you God to damn be trapped it. in this I couldn't press space bar to... Oh, oh, what? Oh, man. Oh, no! Oh, no, wait. I keep pressing jump, and it's not jump! Okay, 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 okay. Oh, okay. they were some kind of tutorial. The music is, um, is really intense. This is our cooking music. Oh, yeah. Uh, 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 get dogs, Poles. What's up? I hey, never tell my... Oh. Oh. Hey, you're coming okay. with me. Uh, okay, All right. okay. Switch you got hands, this. and then I'm in space. Uh, I'm in space, but it doesn't let me... Oh, how do I... How do you gotta how? romance the agent. Show him oh. how much you love him. How do I... I now sentence you to be trapped in this obstacle course for the rest of your days. Not my tub pee oh. sandwich. God, how... If, oh, oops, okay. How, how... How do I do it? Average gamer, you are you are listening to quite quality music uh, gameplay. It's like I can't go into pickup mode. Okay, I'm just in pickup mode. All right, hang on. I need to use the space bar apparently. I guess. Oh my god. I'm getting into it. Oh, oh, oh. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, I'm going this side instead. Right, you got this. You're coming with me. No. Okay, okay, so, so, you got switch it. hands, go, switch hands. and then Q, no, Q does nothing, I just need to grab it, how? Romance him, romance him, no! I, you need to push the hand forward. I did, I did, and it didn't let me, I was pressing Q to push forward and it didn't do anything, oh god. <laughs> Alright, okay. I like how the bear, it looks oh, like the bear is holding a pair of prosthetic oh, hands. Oh my god, it's like, okay, here we go. Can I strafe? Uh, maybe. Oh, whoops. Actually. Yeah, you're definitely strafing already. Yep. Oh my god. No. Okay. It's right. okay. They didn't catch you. Okay, so can I strafe? No, I can't. Can I cue? No, I can't. I can't even get over there. How do I? I'm pressing all the buttons. Gotta do it. I, I can't no. get over enough. I, I can't get over enough. And I can't, I can't press to the left. E was rotate and Q was... Yeah, so uh, if I press um, Q to reach out, it does nothing. If I press A to go over, it does nothing. All I can do mm. is use my mouse and click. Uh, 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 yeah, and my mouse. Oh my god, maybe this is the end of this damn game. <laughs> That would be fine because I have two minutes before I leave. Hey, you're coming with me. Just eat him! Look, okay, hang on. Okay, can't go over, I can't do space. Q, nothing. E, nothing. Oh, uh, okay, okay, E. Ooh. Dead. As Zeus condemned Sisyphus to roll a boulder for all eternity, I don't see you to be trapped in this obstacle course for the rest of your days! Oh, okay. Graphics. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? Fuck yeah, oh, no armor. Oh, I can turn off that stupid. Yeah. Oh. No, it's still it's still there. It's still there. Oh my god, I swear to god. <laughs> what? What is that? I've come to bargain. Oh, oh my god. Can you 
what does it say in the instructions of the romance? Maybe I'm just not like reading it properly. I just want to make a sandwich, man. I just want to make a sandwich. I'm just a bear who wants a sandwich. Uh, you did nothing wrong. Oh, okay, no, sometimes it just goes. Hey. That family's fine. Wrap this Let's button. Put your hand outwards. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, I can't get over it. Give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. As Zeus condemned Sisyphus to roll a boulder for all eternity, Guys, fuck I this game. sentence you to be trapped <laughs> in the world for the It is over. Days. So, that was a sandwich simulator. Oh, no, gamer. It was, it was a really great game. I really enjoyed making a sandwich just like our chefs did. Um, you did. It was a very nice sandwich. Yeah, let's let's go find some more free games that actually allows you <laughs> to make sandwiches. That 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 would be great. I am uh, going to hop off of here and uh, head to work. You all have all the fun ever. See, I need to I need to put up your um your thing. Your um here you go. My sandwich. Sandwich. Yeah. You have chefs too, right? I don't. Aww. Aww. Sybil's yeah. still down there. Hello, hello. Little chef behind the fishbowl. Yeah, at least we at least we still have the at least we still have the chef symbol. Um We will we will see if there is, is any other games. And if there is not, that is it. I am I am done with my life. <laughs> uh where am I going? Oh, uh, There's always two per cat cafe sandwich rush. Right? Uh, is it free? Yes. Ooh, Wait, so no, it doesn't soon. have a price because it's not out yet. My bad. Uh, okay, right. No, 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 no. We're fine. Okay, free. Uh, bare knuckle sandwich. Oh, uh, Buffy stole your sandwich demo. That's weird. Okay. Buffy, you bitch. Ah. Uh -huh. Um, what else we got? So how it happened? Can we not? VR only. Tracking the cryptic. Oh, that's a fucking Sudoku puzzle. Why is that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is sandwich Sudoku a thing? Excuse me. Uh, I mean, I guess we do Sudoku, but uh, good luck with work. Yeah. Bare knuckle sandwiches demo. Okay. Okay, bye. Hey, right, we'll, we'll check out what cooking games there. Cooking. cooking craze. Mixed reviews. Oh, no. It looks like everything I would hate. Oh, no. This looks like everything I'll hate. Play game. Okay, add to library. Cooking craze. Stole this one. Thank you. We're downloading a cooking craze now. Um, I just wanted to make a sandwich. <laughs> why, why can't I just make a sandwich? Uh, yeah. Let me go back through some of your comments while I was like, I was just like smacking my head against the wall. Do we need Family Guy clips? But the, the developer figures out how to make player jump, but half the game is already completed. <laughs> oh, dude, that was like no sandwich for you. I just wanted a sandwich. That's all I wanted. That's all I wanted. That was so weird. It's like, couldn't strafe left, couldn't move left, could rotate hand. Ugh. Maybe he never finished the game. Could make a sandwich even if she wanted to. That's true. That's true. Right, here we go. She eats food, not make it. That's true. It's, it's, it's legit true. 
My game. My game is ready to play. All right, guys. So we're going to play this one instead. I'm really excited. Okay, hang on. None of this. Cooking. Cooking craze. Play. Really excited. Let me get to the volume before it deafens me. Ah, I got it. Ha ha. Are we ready? This looks, this looks great. Yeah. yeah, this looks, this looks like everything I hate. This is also another free game if you want to. So you want to be the world's best chef. That's a tall order. Let's start sweet with donuts. <laughs> Hello, Jacob. First click the dough. Okay, all right. Oh, I just click on it? That's it? Okay. Oh, bam. You want a sundae? Here's your sundae, bitch. Uh, okay. Alright. Hi. You want a donut? I got your donut right here, bitch. Oh, you want a sundae? There's your sundae. I'm gonna dip it in chocolate and then... Oh, shit. Well, here you go. You had that one. It's fine. It's fine. Let's put more in. Here's your sundae, bitch. Here you go. You got that one. You got that one. Oh, it's just one of these ones. God damn it. I just want a sandwich. When do we get to the sandwich? Oh, you're a winner. I am. Give me sandwiches. There's a Papa's Pizza is. We make sandwiches. Oh, damn it. Hi, it's the chef of a special delivery. Hello, average. Welcome to raiding to really, really average games. So this works. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, okay, what am I doing? All right, yep. Oh, I can upgrade shit? Oh, let's upgrade shit. Um, I want... I want nothing. Cool. It's great. It's fine. Totally fine. Um, play. Friends. I... That... Trash dishes. Okay, right. Is this just the same thing again? Oh, okay, you want to... Here you go. Let me put some donuts on. Hold up, bitch, wait. Here you go. Here's your thing. Oh, you want it dipped? Yeah, I got... I got... I got you... I got you dipped right here. There you go. Oh, you look so excited. Here's your thing. And... And here's... Here's... Here's that. There's that. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Hold up. There's... There's one. There's... Two... There's, there's one, okay, there's your, there's your thing, there's one, oh, yeah, yeah, all right, all right, calm down, look, they're so demanding, anyone else, oh, okay, done, we're great at this, uh, can you try and tell you, oh, Minecraft, we're amazing at this. Donuts are kind of close. They deep fried, right? Hang on, they deep fried. Deep frying stuff. Oh, look, we're on level three. How much money do we have? Look at shitloads. Why can't I upgrade something yet? Oh, I don't know what the fuck that is, but. These are all. Useless. Okay, fine. Play. Should I switch my game to, um,. Cooking craze. I'm sure that will really bring new people in, right? Here we go. Cooking craze. Come watch me play cooking craze. Um. Uh, I'm gonna go. Like <laughs> work. All right. When did you working? Okay. Here we go. Wait, wait. Oh, now we got strawberry as well. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Um. Oh, 
one, bitch. My god. Dude. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Oh, we're close. Stay with me. Yes! Nailed it. Oh, look, there's a pandy here. What the hell? Okay. Oh, it prevents things from, from burning, apparently. Okay, cool. Upgrade. Use your burn proof and it will never cook. Oh, my God. Boost. I have boost? You're kidding. All right. This is... Put up on my donut. I want, I want, I want, I want. It's fine, it's fine. All right, here we go. Oh, look at that. Hello, good morning. Two Sundays. Damn. Okay, you want chocolate on a mic one? I got your chocolate right here. Ah, oh, strawberry and... Hi, do you want a Sunday? You better want a Sunday. Yeah, I knew you wanted a Sunday. I could see it on your face. Hi. Sunday, you want chocolate? I got you, I got you. We're closed, apparently. Here's your one donut. Now I want crispy. Yeah, we're amazing. Okay. Oh, I got a daily reward? No way. Oh, I gotta log back in tomorrow. Shit. Okay. Upgrade. What's this? I... Oh, we're making pancakes? Okay. Yes. Coconut? Oh, you want sprinkles now as well? Oh, damn. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I got you. I got you. So that, that, that. Oh, I should have done that. That, 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 that. that. Okay, 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 wait, hold on. I know, I know, I know, I know, it's all out now. Okay, here we go. Damn, okay, it's just all. This is, this is a craze, it's fine. Nailing this game. Well, I guess goal is 200. Yeah, sure. Why not? What is this? What is this upgrade? I don't even know. Okay, whatever. We don't need it. We don't need upgrades. This is like every mobile game ever. It really is, right? I'm really, really feeling it. You want Sunday? Yeah, I knew you wanted Sunday. See it in your face. Uh, you want ch chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. You want a Sunday. You want chocolate. This. Uh, you want a Sunday and 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 chocolate. I actually clicked the wrong thing there, and it let me. That was really interesting. Oh. Wow, it actually protects you. That's hilarious.
you got. They just all want Sundays. They just all want Sundays. They just all want Sundays. I can't do anything. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. So what are you insinuating there? Uh, no, 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 nothing. Sunday on a Saturday? Yeah. I can see it in your face. I can see it in your eyes. It's all I ever asked for. I just, I just know how to please, I just know how to please bitches. That's all. Fine. It's all the same. Alright, okay. We don't need any of those stupid upgrades. It's fine. We got this. Click to pause. Pause? Who needs to pause? Okay. Servers fast? Oh yeah, oh yeah, alright, okay. We got this. Nine. Nine. That's fine. Okay. Oh, I got sprinkles now too. That's fine. You can deal with sprinkles. Okay, you want that and a normal one. You want a Sunday. Okay, yeah, I, I got you. Okay, you want a strawberry sprinkle. And you want that. Oh. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. Now I know. Now I know. Okay. Oh my god, it's gonna burn. It's gonna burn. What do I do? Hurry up, get a donut, get a donut. Oh good. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Da, da, da. You want a donut? Yeah, you want a donut. And you want a donut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bam. Easy. Easy. No mobile game can hold me back. Let's get them on. I forgot. Hi, you want a Sunday? Oh, it's you again. You're always stealing all my Sundays, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, you didn't mess it up. Oh, good. Ah. Uh. Oh, hi. Hi. Can't do anything. This is all Sundays. It's all Sundays. God, you want going wanted to keep the cooking thing going yeah 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 we always do it's just well if you had to leave ellie usually we play free games after that's like themed so i'm going with deep fried because they deep fried their monte cristos yeah i'm attempting to get the closest experience to the food exactly right exactly right this is like this is like what the box but yeah they had to go um chef Lahos had to go to sleep and um chef Wolfie had to go to work yeah 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 but I will, um, go right out. Are you, are you, are you guys working? What's the deal here? 
You're home and in bed. Oh my god, you feel so dozing. That's that's really bad. Alright. Uh, I should change this to what the fox, shouldn't I? Is that a what the what the fox games? Um, cooking and post cooking. Yeah, there we go. That makes more sense. Um, he sleeps at the wheel. You're you're also in bed. I'm not working on my way to the train station. Oh yeah, I remember. Uh, play. Love this. Can you really pause? Okay. Oh, whoops! I forgot to shove stuff on. Oh, sorry. You know, my bad. My bad. My bad. Oh, sorry. Yep, let me go. Three dish combo. Amazing. So it does not give out a comment card. We're gonna have to beat it twice. What's this shit? What? How dare you? I want to beat something twice. That shit on. Hi, buddy. Strawberry. I got you, strawberry. Right here. Yeah. Station bear back. Okay. Ah, I didn't need to cook that one. It's fine. I'll just eat it. Why not try upgrading your equipment? What do you mean so close? What? I need more castabers. Dude, are you kidding? Are you kidding? Oh, wait, wait, what? We're still going? Huh? Oh, okay. I got really confused. I got super confused. Hang on. 
It just gave me a message halfway through. Okay. Like, oh, you're so close. Try upgrading equipment. And then I finished the rest of the level and got it. That was weird. Okay. No, I'm not paying. Go away. What? Oh, okay. All right. Upgrade. All right. Wait, what are we upgrading? I didn't even recommend. Oh, okay. We'll upgrade that. And we'll, we'll upgrade that. Oh. Okay. Oh yeah, this needs to be faster. This is it. This is what we need. Yeah, that needs to be way faster. Okay, alright, let's go. Oh, I got, I got more. I didn't actually mean to do that. Jesus. Okay, alright. Um. I. Oh my god, okay, uh, you, 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 and, um, you, you, you. Oh my god. Now that we need to get more, um, we need to get more plates. That's what we need. I need still one more comic card to get a new. Oh my god, really? What's this? Oh, take the wood. Yeah. That. Okay. Take the wood. Yeah. Oh wait, what? Okay. Oh. Okay. Now this is probably like connect to Facebook and meet more friends. Where do I? Where's the shop? Uh. Ah. Uh. I don't want all this. No, I don't want any of this. Free. No, I don't want any of this. Where's like the actual? Okay, no. 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 Why, why can't I shop? Where do I have to go? You dreading logging back in? Aww. Oh. Yes. Yay. I get stuff. I'm gonna log in every day. Okay, thank you. Can I just... One more level. Okay, alright. Upgrade. Okay, that's where I upgrade. I was like, wait, why can't I access? I really want what this 150. Yes, that's what we want. Okay, good. And then what's this? Get a dog, I guess? Alright. And then. Alright, okay. We don't need any more. We're fine. Okay, play. Without throwing food in the trash, that's wasteful. I don't throw any food in the trash. Hydrate! Thank you. Right. We are ready. One, two, three, four. This one, um.
down, down. Okay, you want one of these, and you want one of these, and you want one of these. 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 And one of these. And one of these. Um, oh. Casimus. Uh. Oh. Okay. Apparently, I need to do something about more customers or something. Okay. Fine. Whatever. Come here. Oh. Oh, I gotta like do it myself to make it more exciting. Why? Why do I need? Fine. What? Oh. Wait. What? So I? Do we have to play it again? Is that the idea? I don't understand. Okay. Damn. You want sprinkles, bitch? I got you sprinkles right here. Yeah. That's easy. Hi. Chocolate sprinkles. You want you want two of these? Yeah. And you want this. Completely closed. Oh, there it is. Is that what I needed? Can I can I move on in my life now? Oh yeah, look, we got a restaurant now with burgers. Burgers are a type of sandwiches, according to Americans. So we've done it. What is it? Okay. I'm gonna make this, and then um, and then we'll raid out somewhere. I mean, we should find another chef. Wouldn't that be cool? Okay, let's have some burgers. So, burger bun. Wait till it's sizzling. Oh my goodness, it takes so long. Okay, and then put bun in burger, and that's it. Okay. You want crepe? Okay. What's your burger? Why isn't anyone getting burgers in my burger joint? Okay. 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 
This one's for me. Now then. Finally, I made like a sandwich. I did something deep fried it and sandwich like the Monte Cristo we did. Nailed this. Nailed this. Okay. Oh my god. Look at all this. Okay, let's upgrade. Cool. Can we make this faster? Yeah, let's make this faster. And let's make this faster. Oh, not enough points, never mind. Okay. Without burning anything. Okay. God, wait, 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 sir, wait. There you go. You got a cake? You got a cake? You got a burger? Hang on, hold up, sir. There's your burger. Look, you can have your cake while you're waiting. And, uh... Freshly made! Yes! Oh, this is for me. Now that. Alright, alright. We're done with this. Let's see who's um <laughs> let's see who's who's up there. I'm trying another another chef. I don't usually do this, but I feel like I feel like we should. Except except we don't actually have Chef Wolfie here. Okay, uh Food, food, and drink. Let's look it up. Let's look it up. See who's on. Um, who we got? Oh my goodness! This is this is a really intense category. This is this is super intense. Okay, let's order by low viewers first. <laughs> okay, hang on. let's see who we got. Uh, who's got the key? What else we got in here? Um, I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see anyone who kind of looks like uh, looks looks like us. You know what I mean? Huh. Oh no, these guys aren't in English. That's a shame. That this is Italian. Oh, a lot of these aren't in English. Yeah, hang on. Uh, oh, okay. Ice ice cream truck simulator. Oh my god, is this guy literally in an ice cream truck? Oh, he is. That's pretty cool. Uh. Oh, this person's making mochi, which we're making next week, by the way. We're making mochi. So, that's exciting. Let me check if they're, uh... Oh, no, they're not in English. I was trying to find someone to rate to, but... There's not many English-speaking people in the in the food category at the moment. Oh, well. It's alright. Yeah, we tried, we tried, we tried. Let's, let's, let's see who's, um... Who else is around? Who haven't we raided before or raided in a while? Let's have a look. Uh, is anyone about to go live? Not we haven't like, raided in a very long time. Should we go raid Fluff? Do you guys want some music? Let's go raid Fluff. We haven't raided Fluff in forever. Love is a rhythm gamer and also an Australian, so good fun. And and I kind of want to ask Fluff where to buy a guitar from, like Guitar Hero, when they don't sell them anymore anyway. So so this 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 works for me. This this works for me. Um, what were you this week on the weekend? I got touch basic koi, but uh, we still want to finish Dragon Age two before moving on into Inquisition. So it's it's on the tables. Uh, there's just some other games that we're we're kind of chilling out with a little bit as well to to give him a bit of a break. Uh, and then Tuesday, Wanted's back. He's still working through his siege newbie 
lessons and he's been concentrating on a new operator every week uh so an attacker and a defender so if you ever want to ask those stupid questions jump back in because you're rusty or just have a game with someone then that's where we're going to be hanging out wanted and even if you're not really into those kind of games of course we're going to hang out wednesday we're back with me i'm hoping to finish i'm really into league of legends now guys um it's a league of legends story game called Bandle tale which i've been really enjoying it's very chill so i'm gonna keep going on trying to finish that game it's it's not a doom week for thursdays so we're going to be skipping this week and then oracle will be back this week he had to have a break this week because of exams but he's going to be back and hopefully finishing amnesia the dark descent if he's up for it i think he's been giving him nightmares a bit but um we're gonna we're gonna try and encourage him such a leak game for real for real right i'm aussie there you go we're all aussie there we go we're all aussie here everyone are honorary aussies even chloe who's a kiwi <laughs> all right here's raid message because i'm super organized if you're sub to the channel you get special raid messages um anyone who's been following along if you're not following please consider doing so we're trying to hit our 400 followers at the moment we're only four followers away which is really exciting and when we hit that we're gonna get doom's mum on for a special for mother's day which you're really excited about tell your friends tell your mothers tell your grandmothers we'll take them all here it's totally fine i sexually identify as an aussie yeah i sexually identify as a kiwi see it works it, it, it totally works so we're going to get a fluff. Please, please make lots of noise. Um, it looks like she's playing, she's playing Rock Band 4 and it looks like she's playing with someone at the moment, which is really good fun. So go chill, have fun, request songs, be good or be naughty. That's totally fine too. 